Philip, was born with Down syndrome. He attended a third grade Sunday school. And the Sunday after Easter, the teacher brought in some legs pantyhose containers, the one that, that looks like large eggs. Each container was empty, and so the students received one of the, the pantyhose containers and were told to go outside. And there they were to look for some symbol of new life and put it in the egg-like uh, container and bring it back into the class. When everyone was back in the classroom, they shared their new life symbols, and the teacher began to open each egg one by one, letting the student explain why it was new life. The teacher came to one, though, that was empty. She opened it up. There was nothing inside. Philip spoke up. He said, that's mine. It's empty. Because the tomb was empty. Silence followed. It wasn't long after that that Philip died. And at the funeral, this class of eight-year-olds, along with their Sunday school teacher, marched up to the casket. They didn't come with flowers. Each one laid an empty pantyhose egg on the casket. The tomb is empty. Soon all the graves in this world will be empty too. Because Jesus is going to raise everyone from the dead, some to eternal life and some to the second death. New life is found in the empty tomb of Jesus. Do you belong to him? Thought for the day.